Hosh here. Welcome back to DMC Devil May Cry. Last time we shot a monkey that was hanging out on a ferris wheel and now we're down an alleyway in what looks like the worst part of London. Weird how life works. Welcome to the Order. Not what I was expecting. That's the idea. The demons are amongst us, Dante. They are enslaving mankind. And the best way to combat sleep, them is by being in a garage. Or fighting back. Though in a very advanced garage, I'll give you that. We are a small handful of freedom fighters. We are the last and only line of defense. Defense? You got no chance. We don't leave things to chance. We've accumulated vast intelligence on the demons and their collaborators. World leaders, bankers, pop stars. We can hit them where it hurts. And this all fit in that small garage. They never once went down any stairs. Who the hell is this guy? Oh my god, that's Virgil, isn't it? That is straight up Virgil. It could only be one person. That's crazy. I didn't expect to Amazing. be introduced to him so early on. Jesus Christ. Dante. It really is you. Oh, Virgil, you are looking a lot more dapper than you used to. I'll give you that. You don't remember me. No. I mean, you always had style, but... I don't know, there's something very English gentleman about this, isn't there? Uh, not much. I had meningitis when I was seven. Why my memory? Why? <laughs> they told me I had a car accident that resulted in total amnesia. Age? Seven. Dun dun dun! Plot twist. Point. Well, meningitis is a human affliction. You are not human, Dante. All war is fought with deception, and you have been deceived. Your past has been hidden from you for a reason. Rewind a bit. Who are you again? My name is Virgil. I established the order to help find a way to fight the demons. Besides swords and bullets, you mean? Such weapons can win battles, but not the war. We use force, yes, but... We also use intelligence, politics, propaganda. Ah, uh, because that's what really was missing from the original Devil May Cry. Politics. Make a dent. With the two of us working together, I believe that we can defeat them. So that's what this is about. You need me to fight the demons, help you save the world. What else were you planning on doing with your life? Also, what else did you think you they were asking you really for, nice, Dante? But, uh, you have no other skills time. other than Trust killing issues, demons. Alone, that kind of thing. Dante, I don't think you understand what is at stake. They weren't bringing you here for tea party. Turn your back on me, I'm powerless to stop you. But you'll be making a grave mistake. Not just for yourself, but for mankind. For mankind? Yes. What makes you think I give a shit? <laughs> well, at least he's blunt about it. At least give me a chance to show you. Show me what? Who you really are. This dialogue is already very, very cliched ridden. And I feel like it's going to only get worse as we go on through. Ah, oh, paradise. That's, that's, that's nice, I guess. Looking a little bit run down, but it's actually quite pretty. I'll give it that. It's also nice to see a part of this game that's bright for once, you know. Oh, wait, no, no, we're back in darkness again. Oh. This was your home. Sweet Fedora. He really has gone it. down the English you gentleman were. route. Cat, open the gateway. Said open the gateway, not like gang tag the area. What are you doing? Our world and limbo are very closely superpositioned. They collide in places causing what we call rifts. It's here, in the rifts, that we can create gateways to and from Limbo. I think most people would call them rifts. Uh, don't think that that's a unique word that you came up with. Too good. Pretty sure that's in the it's dictionary. The a compound I created based on an old Wiccan recipe. Sea salt, shark oil, iron shavings, desiccated squirrel semen, wolf hair. Good stuff. Ha. Go ahead. Good joke. The house holds secrets. I found mine. Now it's your turn. How will I get back? We'll take care of that. 
Let's be careful. You can get rough in there. I like it rough. Ugh. Oh, we're going all shimmery. Oh, now we're gone. Is this really going to work? He doesn't seem to care. He's raw. Just like you were when I first found you. Uh, character development foreshadowing, I think, maybe, possibly, I don't know. Hey, we get to play the game. Oh god, there's still crazy ghosty images of them both. Yeah, Dante, Dante is, well, he's an annoying brat in this game, but I'm alright with that. Whee! Yeah. Because Dante's, Dante's personality has been messed around with a little bit. He used to be... Yeah, a wise-cracking asshole, but you used to kind of like him for it. He, he said the right things at the right time, had the best one-liners, and now he's kind of just turned into a spoilt brat, I'm not sure I like that that change. So this was my home. Well, show me your secrets. That was your home. Looks more like a... It's your holiday home. In the, in the middle of a freaking void. This thing looks like it was built in Italy. How rich were your family, Dante? Ooh, I missed a bit. Hello, cocoon. You're mine. Can't get through there. And yeah, there's bits falling off of it. It's a bit in disrepair now, but... My god, this place looks expensive. What went wrong in your life that made you... have to live in a trailer? Kind of a good thing that your dad's in the underworld and can't get out, because he'd be seriously disappointed in you if he could see you now. I am confused. Everywhere is a dead end. And these reflective services are doing my head in. Oh, I can't get up there, can I? No. No. Uh, where do I go, then? Uh, what do I do? I'm hearing a beep. That's a clue to a secret, but I... Really can't be bothered to stick around and find out where it is. It's quite pretty, this set. I'll give it that. It's, uh... It's not overall too bad to look at. I just... I wish the, the colours were maybe a bit sharper or a bit brighter. It does seem to be very murky, this game. I think that's probably the point. I think that's a stylistic decision. Give him the benefit of the doubt on that one. But oh. That's a key! Yeah! A copper key! Alright! First ever one! I get to use that on a door sometime. As you do with keys. <laughs> that's some stellar commentary there. Telling you all what keys do. They open doors. And sometimes locks. So yeah, I don't... I'm not sure about Virgil yet. I haven't hung out with him enough. Another Divinity Statue, that's nice. I get some upgrades. Um, may come back to that. Don't need it right now, but I may come back to that. Uh, there's some kind of blue lock there, but I, I don't think I can get through it. Oh no, I've been forced to walk. So it's cutscene time. I remember this place. That's good, because I don't. Although you're going to inception your memories into uh, the foreground, so it doesn't matter too much. Well. And who the hell are you? Oh, your dad. It's your dad. Sparta. It's your dad with his face carved off. My dad. Because you can't have him, like... Oh, God! Okay. We're in it already, are we? Come on, then! I got too used to, uh... Oh. I'm missing. I got too used to, uh, nothing happening. When something finally did happen. It took me a bit by surprise. Oh god, there's more of them. Ah, <laughs> oh, but they're still just jobbers, aren't they? 
You guys can't touch me. <laughs> Gameplay is very satisfying. Who the hell is this? Hello. Death Knight. Well, he sounds fun. You're up next. He's got a shield. Oh, God. Okay. Ah, okay. Uh, what do I do? What do I do about this guy? I can't shoot him. I can't slash him. I'm going to I'm gonna have to count here, aren't I? I've got a horrible feeling I'm going to have to wait for him to attack me. Ah, oh, mate. What the hell's going on here? There we go. There we go. Yeah. Use my evasion to my advantage. And then just stomp him. Yeah. That took me far too long. Far too long. What are you trying to show me? Uh, nothing, Dante. It's a... It's not sentient. It's just a portrait. Oh, maybe I'll take it back. Maybe it is sentient. Oh dear. Oh, okay. Maybe that's a good thing for some reason. New weapon? New weapon? Yeah. And a new one of those. How convenient. And try it out. Arbiter. A demonic axe who swings a slow but powerful. Arbiter is especially effective against shields. Well, that's good. Uh, that happens to be something that I need. Something good against shields. Okay, um... Radio? Arbiter... Oh, I see, so... Right, so you don't really change weapons. Not so tough now. Just a combination of buttons will automatically pull out a different... That, that makes kind of no sense. Uh, in... In previous Devil May Cry, you had to switch your weapons on the fly to, to use them with the same kind of attack buttons. But this game seems to have essentially a different button set up for each uh, weapon. Jeez. All right. Arbiter is slow, by the way. This axe is very slow. Oh, God, it hurts, though, doesn't it? <laughs> it bounced them off the floor. Woohoo! Ah! He hit me. I'm gutted about that. Oh, that's not going to work. Yeah! Smack him in the face with the axe! Get him in the... Ah! Yeah, that's it. That's it. Surely that's it. No. God, this guy's taking... Hits! Never mind. I get B? B? I thought I did rather well, but oh no, I did get hit. I did get hit. It's a bit, a bit upsetting. Ooh, that's different. Wasn't expecting that. I have to say, for um, the top level difficulty, uh, that I'm currently able to access. I don't think I can get back up there, can I? No. Uh, yeah, for the top level difficulty that I'm currently able to access in this game. It's not that tricky at the moment. I am imagining they will get a lot harder as I go on. I hope so. I could do with possibly a little bit more Whoa! moments, if that makes sense. Right, let's get these. These have goodies in them. Very important to always grab the goodies. Move on, I guess. So I'm doing a lot of, um, of camera panning and um, diddling around just to make sure that I don't really miss any secrets. Although, to be honest, if I wasn't recording, I'd probably spend longer doing that, so I'm probably still going to miss quite a few of them. Oh, hello, guys. You guys really do like popping out of the ground. Makes me wonder who planted you. Uh, 
That was meant to go the other way, but I'll use it as an escape tool. There we go. Alright. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I like this axe. I like this axe a lot. Ow. Jesus. Hurts. Oh, I messed that up, though. Oh, I'm still messing it up. Oh, no. But the evasion thing still works, so that's good. So you can... You can kill them with Rebellion. But... <laughs> oh, but the axe is satisfying, though. The axe is very satisfying. Oh... Follow the ghostly representations of yourself when you were, like, seven. No, he got meningitis when he was seven, didn't he? So it must be before then. Five? Yeah, five or six. I don't know. Woohoo! I can break open red doors now! Because I've got a massive fire axe! That's what you use axes for, right? I mean, chop through doors. I hear a beeping. There's a beeping. Don't worry, I will free you, lost soul, by chopping you into tiny pieces. I'm the good guy! I can't get through there. Okay, so if the red doors are... Yeah, okay, I think I get it. So the red doors can be destroyed with the red weapon. Maybe I'll get a... Oh. Different weapon to open those doors later on, and now I'm gonna get panned. Yes! Okay. Uh, oh, I do not have a lot of room to move here. Oh, why am I using that weapon? Oh, I'm still using that weapon. Oh, that's good, though. Yeah. Oh, dear. This is not good. Oh, no, maybe it is good. Maybe it is good. I've got his back. I've got his back. Oh, I've been... Oh, this is not good. This is not stylish at all. Oh. Oh, no. No. Oh, I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Shit. I lost a life over that. Now I've got to wake up. Stop using rebellion on guys with shields and stop getting stabbed as well from halfway across the flipping screen. Okay, that's a bit better. Oh, the float combos. <laughs> yeah, that was brilliant. I can't believe I got an A off of that. I spent most of that fight getting my ass me. kicked. I remember this. I also lost my only gold orb, and I'm a bit gutted about that. To step up my game. Whoa, that's a very close. Oh, we're going into Dante's eye. Whoa. Now, apparently Dante gets serious migraines. They're no joke. Whoa. Where the hell are we now? This place has a nice colour palette. It's very blue. I approve. Okay. Lots of floaty places. Hey guys, uh, remember that bit out of Dishonored? I'm not saying who came up with the idea first, but somebody needs to sue someone. <laughs> Although, did, did Dishonored do it first? I, I? I really doubt it. Well, that's a good point, actually. Who was the first person My to dream. do the suspended platforms in the middle of a strange, void-like, dystopian nightmare? Because Skyrim did it as well, I think. In fact, all the Elder Scrolls probably did it. Now that I think about it. Oh, that's that's cool. Orphean Demon Pull. Throw out the Orphean Whip to grapple enemies or objects and pull them towards Dante. Uh, so like the um, uh, Nero's Hand from Devil May Cry 4. That's pretty cool. Uh, a fion? Is that how you say that? I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to look up that word. Oh yeah. Oh right, I can do. Uh, okay. I think I understand what he wants me to do with that. 
That's cool though. Um, I understand this uh, mechanic. It was given to me in, in Devil May Cry 4. I played that game. It's good. That's all good. I, I get it. Can't wait to use it on an enemy, really. Ooh. Oh, wow. Surfing. Awesome. Okay. Now we come. Okay, and the house does not fall down. That's totally plausible. Although that said, do any of these things fall down? <laughs> yeah, I realise I said something stupid there. Oh, thank God there's an easier way of killing those bastards, because they're really annoying. Get him off the side. Get him off the side. I broke before I could hit him off the edge. Uh, everyone's dying before I even have my fun with them. That was very close. Very close to getting myself destroyed then. Okay. What now? Uh, what's this? Do I do I smash it with the axe? I'm assuming I smash it with the axe. All right. No, maybe not. Oh no, it is. It is. Oh, I made him turn his head. And that is good for some reason. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Dante. Dante. It really is you. This isn't confusing at all, guys. It's not confusing at all. I'm totally keeping up with what's going on here. Okay. So what else have you got? Alright, so now I'm back. Okay, um, what do we do? I hear a secret. I'm gonna try and get after that. I'm not sure where it is. Ooh, oh no, door, door, have a key, have a key for door. Great. Oh, that's, uh, that's weird. Okay, what's, oh. Ah! Oh, right, it's, um, it's like a bloody palace thing. Great. Cool. Um, kill everyone. That seems pretty easy. Uh, how do I... Which, which button's back? <laughs> I know how to play this game. Which button's back? <laughs> uh, that one. Ah, uh, that one. <laughs> right. Kill everybody really quickly. How long have I got? Minutes! I killed... Oh, six people. Yeah, that, that is totally unbelievably doable. Yeah. This does not seem that difficult. Ha <laughs> ha! Beat him! Prod him till he dies! Oh, he's gone. He's over the side. That was bullying on that last one. Just, just bullying. Oh, what's this? Oh, I like this. This is new. What is it? Health cross fragment. Collect four health fragments to create a health cross. And I assume a health cross will increase my my health bar? Like, give me more maximum health? I am assuming, anyway. So that was worth it, yeah. That was totally worth it. Great fun. Oh! Didn't... Didn't unnerve me at all. Didn't unnerve me at all. I... Knew that was coming? Even if I didn't? No. Too much of a badass to ever get freaked out by something like that. I promise. Ooh, okay. Go through the door. Sparta! They're here! They're here! They found us! What the hell happened to you? We've got to get out. Now! Hurry! Come on, quickly! Uh, I guess you, that's your mum. Uh, 
She seems nice. I mean, a little bit afraid of the edges, but I would be too if uh, a whole pack of demons were coming to uh, kill me and my family. Honestly, keeping it all together, considering. Oh, okay. I feel like you just being here is wrecking this house even more. Oh, good. Because the one thing that those flying assholes needed was shields. That's not going to be dead annoying. Uh, oh, dear. I'm going to get bombed. What the hell am I supposed to do here? I haven't got... I can't get to him. Ah. Uh, right. Right, let me think on this. Let me think on this. Get away from... Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. You just got this power. And then they give you flying guys with shields. Of course. Grab them. Grab them, bring them down. Oh, did you see that? Blew him up with his own bomb. Come on. How did they find us? Uh, okay, that. I know that voice. It was satisfying. I will give him that. And that's the thing I've always liked about Devil May Cry's gameplay, is that there are so many moments, intentional or not, and trust me, that was not intentional. Uh, but intentional or not, there's so many moments where you just go, that was badass. Thank you for that badassness. Uh, what, do, what do I need? Um, I've only got one upgrade. It would be nice to upgrade the axe. Um, what's this? Oh, great. He goes in a line. Oh, that's nice. Oh, throw the axe. It's alright, I guess. Yeah? Yeah, that'd be quite... Uh, he's actually quite useful. Um... And the fault line they're launched into the air as well, so... It actually just launches everybody behind the guy as well. Um... I think I'm going to go for that. Just because, um... I tend to use the pause combos a lot more. Certainly using the pause combo a hell of a lot more with the, uh, Rebellion sword. The Rebellion sword. With Rebellion. Is that... Eva? Mom? So they'll show the mother's face, but they won't show Spada's. Bit weird, that. But I'll, t I'll take it. I love you, Dante. Well, that was sweet. Oh! Fucking demons. Who could have seen that coming? Getting interrupted during a poignant family moment. I love our way back to these guys again. Oh. oh, okay. So it can be used to take away people's shields. Gotcha. Like that, in fact. Oh dear. Yeah, the axe is better. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> God damn, that axe is fun. When it hits, it's like, yeah. I'm enjoying it. Like I said, the gameplay is pretty good. Are the characters better than they were? No. Is the story that good? No. Is it fun to hit demons in the face with a multitude of sharp implements? Absolutely. And now I've got a scythe. Wicked. Osiris. An angelic scythe, particularly useful for dealing with large crowds of enemies. So, low damage, but wide area, I'm assuming. Easy combos as well. Look at that. Bloody hell. Okay. Um, it grants a damage bonus when fully charged and gets that charge from striking enemies. That's interesting. Okay. Alrighty, yeah, then. And then it's on the other trigger. Got you. Wow. Okay. This is going to take some getting used to. <laughs> um. 
Oh yeah, it's kind of got a, like a glint to it now that it's fully charged. I get it. Mmm, bloody hell. <laughs> they can't get near you. Nice. Although, to be fair, that one combo that I keep doing with Rebellion is, is quite spinny around me. So, I think I just like the combos which hit from all directions. Okay, yeah, Wicked Weapon. Love it. How about this chapter has given me two new weapons? Not one, two. Oh, right, yeah, and it, this gate's blue, which means I can get through it with this now. Wicked! Oh, okay, let's go. Get away from me! Oh, hello. I think I was going to miss you, did you? No, no chance. No chance. Now I've got another upgrade, so what do, what do I get? Uh, let's have a look at the Osiris things. It's another pause combo. I'm probably going to take that, to be honest with you. Unless there's something better. Okay, that is wicked. And unnecessary. But pretty good. Okay. Alright. That's... Okay, cool. I'm, I'm wondering which ones to do with these. That is wicked. Jesus. And there's a second level of that as well. Uh, that's a pull them into the air one. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, usually when I'm in, there, in the air I'm chasing somebody though. I don't think I've ever... I don't think I really jump into the air unless there's somebody there already. That's very good, but there's a big charge-up time on that, isn't there? That's quite good. That's a multiple people version of the Stinger. Feed. Doubles of this thing. I think I am, yeah, gonna take that. I, I told you I would! I told you I would! And it turns out, yeah, like, no. You gotta have the standard pause combo. Because they're just like your regular combo, but better. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, it's never easy, is it? It's never easy. Oh, shit. There's, uh, there's no ground there. I feel like I could blame that on the camera angle and not on me. So I'm going to do that. Alright. That's good. I'm loving it. No, wrong, wrong weapon. That's the right one. <laughs> there we go. Cool. Wicked. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. There's that dude over there. I wonder if I can shoot him. I think I can shoot him. Uh, I have a feeling I'm going to be here all day if I do this, though. Yeah, the, I, I don't think that's a, a goer. Not unless I can get across there somehow. No. There probably is a way, but I have no idea how to. Meanwhile, smashing through things is still fun. Cutting up spiders is still fun. And now I'm in a library, which is uh, less fun, to be honest. Although I'm sure something's about to happen to make it more fun. A blue rose. Blue roses. The symbol of impossibility. I think. Or at least that's what Metal Gear Solid 4 told me. Oh, it's giving Dante another migraine. War is for the decisions. You be deceived. You cast me in from me for a reason. Uh, we're back here. Oh, good. Not even a different area. Just. Let's do it again. Okay. 
Actually, it is slightly different, isn't it? It's slightly different. Okay. Oh, there it is again. There's the big thing I've got to hit. Break the other chain off of him. Actually, he has more than one chain, doesn't he? Um, uh, why do I have a feeling I'm going to come back to this more than a few times? Oh, that's uh, cool. It's another hook thing. Orphean Angel Lift. Throw out the Orphean Whip to grapple enemies or objects and lift Dante towards them. I think it's Orphean. Or... It could be a Fian. Uh, I'm not sure. If I'm saying that wrong, I'm terribly sorry. The moment I'm... I'm done recording, you can bet your bottom dollar I'm gonna look that up. Nice. Ah, stylish. Unnecessary roll at the end, but we love it. Uh, lift towards enemy. Oh, all oh right. Ah, wicked. It's like the stinger, but easier to input and without the sword. Which, now that I'm thinking about it, is not quite as good. Oh, it does, however, mean I can get up to those bastards very, very easily. Oh, yeah. Okay. That is quite nice. Ooh, concept art. That's useful. I'll make a mental note to look at that and then probably never will. I like this side. I like this side a lot. There is something very bow staffy about the movements that he's using with that side. Um, there's something very cool and bojitsu y about it that I really, really like. I suppose it would be. I mean, a scythe is just a bow staff with a curved blade on the end. Oh, wicked. Okay, that was cool. Oh, I like that. Oh, we're here already. Jesus. And no other secrets. I'm just going to have to bash this open. Wicked. There we go. And this will break down, and he'll turn his head the other way, and then I will be back in the mansion again. Right? Is that right? I hope at the end of all this I get to go inside that statue and, like, wear it like a Power Ranger. This was your home. We can have like an 100 foot monster battle for the ending fight scene. If that happens, it's officially my favourite game ever. That's how confident I am that it won't happen. <laughs> oh, that's cool. The proper tanks is especially useful for parrying ranged projectiles back at the enemy. It, it certainly can do that. Okay. That's awesome. Great, we can play cricket. Oh. oh, this is going to be slightly difficult now, isn't it? Oh, okay. Remembering to do that in the middle of a massive melee brawl is going to be quite tricky, I think. Okay, let's get rid of these shields. Oh, I can't get into the things. Oh, God, there he is. Okay. You are annoying. Flying bastards, man. Come here. What am I doing? Probably just grab him. Yeah. I keep forgetting that I can do that. And it makes things a hell of a lot easier. B. Uh, again, I think I deserve to have a lot less than that. Like I was thinking C. 
But it'll do. It'll do. If you want to keep giving me more than I'm aware... Is his face blurred out again? This is not subtle, guys. It's not subtle. I remember. I remember my mother. Her name was Eva. She gave this to me. I had a brother, too. We were a family. I had no idea of the danger we were in. The demons found us. When they broke in, I saw him. My bank manager. Oh, looking less like a bank manager now. <laughs> she gave her life so that we could escape. I will never forget what he did to her. Except that I just did, in fact, forget for a long period of my life what he my did father, to her. Sparta took my brother and I away. He separated us. It is safely amongst the humans. Wiped our memories to protect us. That's, That's nice of them. went black. Until now. And the initial part of the hero's journey is complete. Fantastic. Wicked. I would have been disappointed if I didn't get to use that ability to hang off some chandeliers. It would seem like a waste of potential. Ooh. Very almost fell off there. Oh, I can't grab that from there. Ooh, hate. That's, that's not a good sign. Can I pull that? Yeah. Okay. Oh, boy. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Oh, I'm liking this. I'm getting out of here. Keep running. I, I'm assuming keep running. Yeah. Gotta keep the old. Oh, ah, again, almost fell off. Oh. Yeah. And now I'm back because I met this arbitrary point in the mansion. That had to be here and not anywhere else. You're my brother. Your twin brother. And I've been looking for you for a long time now. Our mother gave these to us. I think she knew that this moment would come. That we would find each other. Oh. So you, father, she gave you friendship Sparta, necklaces. That's nice. Vanish forever. A fate worse than death, they say. He's never coming back. Well, that sucks. Also, you didn't blur out his face then. Right then. Anymore. In that little bit of a flashback. Where we come from. But you what took the trouble to, to blur out his face in the portrait all, and in the picture. I want to know who's responsible for all this. That's so weird. Anyway, I think that's the end of chapter two. Yeah, it is. It is. Let's see how well I've done. Probably awfully. I do remember dying. Oh wow, triple S on the star points though, I'll take that. S on time as well. Completion is bloody awful. I missed loads of stuff. Great, good to know. No items used, but I did die. Oh wow, I still get an S though. That's That'll do. That'll do. I was not expecting something that high, but I will take it. Wow, triple S on star points as well. I'm dead chuffed about that. Well, I'll leave it there. That's chapter two of DMC Devil May Cry. I'll be back with chapter three. We're going to keep going through these episodes until we finish this game. Until then, I'll catch you all next time. Hosh out!